A Gentile at the Jewish Singles Mixer? What are you doing here, man? I love Jewish girls. Why? Hello. <laughs> well, um, when I went away to college, I had never been away from home before, Adam. I miss my mom. I was having a hard time making decisions on my own. So, uh, anyway, sophomore year came around and I started dating this Jewish girl, Rebecca Rabinowitz. And just like that, Adam, all of my decisions went away. <laughs> it was like I didn't have to think anymore. <laughs> when we would go out to eat, I no longer had to decide what restaurant to go to. <laughs> when we go to Banana Republic, I no longer had to decide what color shirt to buy. <laughs> when I wanted to go out with my friends, Adam, I no longer had to decide who my friends were going to be. <laughs> It was so funny, it made you laugh and laugh and laugh, and I think everybody should go see it, and you don't have to be Jewish to enjoy it. I'm a Gentile, and I loved it. I get to learn the Torah so that I can be bar mitzvah. I get to bathe in the makva so that I'll be a clean Jew. And I get to get circumcised because foreskin is dirty. Did somebody say foreskin? So, I read a press the other day, the mile slips, a piece flies up, hits me in the bottom, and I've been cockeyed ever since. <laughs> I love that joke! The important thing to remember here is that as a Jew, you have to pick something on the menu and alter it beyond all recognition! Okay? okay. This is extremely important. So we're, we're, we're gonna practice this. This is big, this is big. Oh, this is big. Here we go, hypothetical. Okay, here we go, hypothetical. Practice it. Ah, good evening, welcome to Expensive Food with Attitude. I will be your server by then. Tonight we have a yummy side salad with gorgeous gorgonzola, crunchy candied walnuts, scrumptious dried cranberries, super pears, and a honey soy vinaigrette to die for. Go. Okay. First half of it's possible, Barbe. Could you please change that side salad to an entree? Keep talking, buddy. Keep talking. <laughs> uh, would you mind substituting blue cheese instead of gorgonzola, apples instead of cranberries, pecans instead of walnuts, and that a uh, honey soy vinaigrette to die for? Um, uh, could you put that on the side? One last, yes. I couldn't stop laughing from the beginning to the end. I would recommend it to anybody. Come, Come see, see Jutopia. I'm going to buy tickets for my whole family.